Frankie Cordes, and I'm 11 years old. My name is Shane Cordes, and I'm 14 years old. I remember last season, I think it was the spring season, and I was standing on the sidelines with your dad. And we realized together, probably about the same moment, like the first time you guys stepped onto the field for the very first time, like you were both on the same team. How did that feel? I mean, do you guys have any connection to that at all? Yeah, I felt good. It was like we were both there helping each other out and doing stuff together. Yeah, I just wanted to go on with him, like like go on the same line with him and like go through the line and tackle the quarterback. Yeah, me too. So, Frankie, you're 11, and how old are you, Shane? 14. 14. So you got three years difference. You were able to play on the same team, which yeah. is kind of cool. Yeah. Frankie, you're a considerable amount smaller than Shane, yeah. right? <laughs> how does that play into you guys playing football together? Um, Shane, is there anything as an older brother that you try to help Frankie out with? or? Yeah, I like to, I like to help him get stronger and teach him some of my like tricks and stuff or whatever I do. And he's improved a lot. As being my little brother, he's pretty decent. Has what Frank has has Shane helped you? Do you think? Yeah, he he always says when I'm like working out here or something, he always comes he always comes over to me and like says to like put more weight on it and stuff. Like, so he's kind of challenging a little bit. Yeah, yeah. And not just here, just at home too. When we're wrestling or fighting or whatever, trying to get bigger, stronger, and more aggressive, I work him pretty hard. Does he work you hard? Do you think that's legit, or do you think he's just beating up on you? Both. <laughs> yeah. Do you think that this experience that you're having on the Argos as brothers, is there any value to this for you guys? Do you, do you sense that this is kind of cool or important or yes. something that you're going to be able to look back on? Yeah, yeah, I prefer being on the same team with him because it just <clears throat> makes me feel good when he does something good or does a good play or something like that. It yeah, helps. me too. Like, uh, like if we're, if if we make it to the NFL, I want to be on the same team and stuff. That'd be cool. Yeah. So you have the same dreams, basically. What are those dreams? To get in college and get on a good football team and be drafted. Like, well, I had a dream about me and Shane on the same team and like, like just. Like on the same play, every single play of the game, just working. That's cool. So, but this season you're not going to be on the same teams, right? No. I'm too big for this kind of league. And he's not big enough for majors. Okay. <clears throat> so, is that going to change any of the dynamics a little bit? I mean, how are you guys going to work that out in terms of helping each other? I'll be at basically every one of his games and cheer him on. Yeah, I'll be honest, games too. That's a good question for you, Frankie, because I, I mean, we've been around each other for a long time. Yeah. And, you know, it's like, I remember when, Frankie, Panthers. you were, I think you were wearing diapers. I don't even know. <laughs> yeah, we were on the Panthers. Yeah. I, how old were you then? Like five, oh, yeah. maybe? Yeah, like five or four. Running around on the sidelines because <laughs> yeah. you were too small to play. Yeah. Do you have any memory of watching Shane play football when you were little like that? Yeah. I, um, like... I remember one play, I watch it sometimes when my Shane's friends come over. I remember a play, first play of the game, first game of the season. Him, they kick it off and Shane like runs it back to the field, um, touchdown. I remember that too. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I, you guys remember something else. Kickers. You're both oh, kickers, yeah. right? That's right? Let's talk about that because it's like, I, if, I don't know for certain, but I think in the punt, pass, and kick, you guys probably both have the longest kicks. Yeah. Well, if it weren't for the ball being stopped or it rolled, we would have definitely gotten the farthest. I got 55 yards. He did, too. So you both kicked 55 yards? Yeah. How do you feel? I mean, that's three years three mm -hmm. years younger than you. He kicked just as far as you did. Well, mine got a bad bounce at the end, you know. Mine got a really good good bounce going forward. We won the national championship together. Yes. Tell me about that. What is it like to win <laughs> something like that together? It was like... So fun because when we were on line, we were both basically linemen at the time. And when we were picked to go to San Diego, we were um, we were both boosting it up on the line and stuff. And then uh, the last game for the championship, he was about he was getting the ball and stuff, and everyone was cheering on his name. And but that felt pretty good to be him. Yeah, I got the ball and 
somebody passed it off to me and I was juke I was trying to juke some kid out, I was standing still, he ran after me, I got tackled <laughs> and it kinda hurt. It's good. Do you have do you feel like you have a responsibility to Frankie and Frankie, do you feel like you have a responsibility to Shane? And if so, what are those responsibilities? Um I feel like I'm responsible for watching over him and helping him with whatever he needs help with and like, making him better. Yeah, like uh, like at his games, he like always wants us to like like tape him on a phone and stuff. Like when he kicks the ball, he he said so, so I can go like like hit a guy really hard when he kicks the ball. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> Getting a fight right here. I know. <laughs> <laughs>